It's apartment update time. It's Friday and I had someone come this morning and help me hang up a ton of stuff. And the apartment is just feeling more and more cozy. And I just had to start off the vlog by showing you guys. So obviously we have the dining table here, but we just hung up the, we, he for sure did it, not me. This beautiful piece of art above the credenza. I just love it. It gives so much height because I mean, there's such tall ceilings. So we wanted to use that gives some height to this area. I just love it. I'm hoping to like decorate this a little, have some tchotchkes on there. I'm still waiting on a storage ladder that's gonna go right there and I can use that to like decorate things as well. But I am so happy with how the dining room area is looking. We've got more artwork. So I'm still, well, I do have a rug in the hallway and I just need to figure out if that is for in here or in my bedroom. I need Ryan's help. So I'm just waiting on that. He's out of town right now, <laughs> but I'm so happy I got rid of these boxes that were all along my couch so I can really see it. I changed the artwork on my TV. I'm like obsessed with the Samsung frame TV. It's so fun. And then this I've been eyeing forever. Like even before I knew where I was living, I knew I wanted this in my apartment. It's like a two piece wall art situation. Got it on Etsy. They make it to order. So they like sent me pictures. They're like, do you like how this looks? But I love it so much. It's just, it's 3D too. Whoa. It's like so cool. Um, we wanted them to be a little bit further apart, but unfortunately there was something on the back of the wall that was blocking that. So we did this and I'm not mad about it. I mean, the wave, see how the wave literally connects it. So it's supposed to be like that kind of. My sweet friend Cassidy was here earlier. We were doing a fitting for fashion week and she in her AM Uncovered that I had her on, she showed this, which is just, it looks like a book, but she kept it on her coffee table and it's storage so you can hide your remote. She got like a three pack on Amazon. So she was like, do not buy one. I will just give you my extra. So I was so happy about that. With that being said, I'm still waiting on my coffee table cause it's also made to order. And I wanted it to have like a split in the wood, um, like a very specific look. So they're making it to look exactly like the one I liked. Um, but it's just gonna be like a long rectangle. And so that'll go on there. But I mean, this is just looking good. This is like grown up. And then in here, don't mind the clothes. Like I said, I have all my fashion week stuff just kind of out. Out. But you guys, I think already saw the lamps, but we hung up the two mirrors above the nightstands today and I'm so obsessed. It gives a hotel feel for sure. I love the lamps. I love how the lamps are a little bit in front of the mirrors. We did that on purpose. He accidentally messed up the holes, so we're gonna fill those in and paint them over. That's okay. I'm kind of leaning towards not while I'm washing my walls at this point. I really do like how bright it is. It's good for filming in here. And like, what if I get tired of the lime washed walls after a while? So with that being said, I'm gonna have to find some sort of artwork, like a big piece of art to go over my bed. But I think I'll find one I like. And I think that is all the updates, but happy Friday, you guys. It's Labor Day weekend. I forgot one more thing. We hung this up in here and it fits the space so perfectly. I really didn't wanna get rid of this. This is a really special piece to me. I wanted to have it forever. So if I didn't keep it here, I was gonna send it to my house in Florida and just have it in storage basically because it's just such a special special piece. It's by Gray Mallon and uh, I think it's so cool. So it works perfectly. A lot of you guys had commented you should put it in the bathroom and I completely agree. It's my little Florida bathroom <laughs> and I really like it. I think it looks really nice. It's like the only color we've got going on, but I love it. I just ran my dishwasher and one thing I love about it is it has this little red laser dot so you know if it's on like if it's actively going or not, which is so great. Gonna go run a few errands. I'm wearing this little workout dress from Abercrombie that I love so much. And then some New Balance sneaks. Actually using this bag too, which is also from Abercrombie and I've been using it a ton. I think it is sold out on Abercrombie, but I found a similar one on Anthropology, and it's linked on my LTK. Back now and I obviously rewarded myself by getting an iced coffee. It's Friday, I'm getting emails, need to respond to those and plan out my next week and a half because fashion week technically starts, I think next Wednesday or maybe Thursday. I forget like what the exact day is, but there's events starting on Tuesday. Also going to the US Open this weekend and then another time next week. So I was like planning out my outfits in my head for that. Really excited. But, and I also just scheduled a Whole Foods grocery order because I want to like actually cook. I'm going to have a pretty wholesome weekend, by the way. So welcome back to another weekend in my life in New York City. I don't know if I fully introed it, but I just wanted to like get it going. Have plans tonight. My friend Seb's birthday was yesterday and we're doing like a chic cocktail night at the Nines, which I'm really excited about, which hopefully will end at Acme or a club of sorts is her goal. So I'm excited. I'm like loading up for that. Tomorrow's the first Georgia game of the season. 
I'm so excited. Ryan got a last minute invitation to um, for tickets to go see the opening game in Atlanta. So he's gone. Yeah, so I'm having some friends over to watch the game tomorrow. And Sunday, I'm going to the US Open. Brooke and Ben are having a party. Monday, we'll just be here doing things. So it's gonna be a really well-rounded vlog. I think it's gonna be really nice, but I'm gonna get some work done and kind of end out my week and plan next week and drink my iced decaf latte. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I've got four rollers in my hair. I Dyson air up to the rest. We're getting ready for the night of nights, aka night out on the town. We're going to this place called The Nines, which is just like swanky cocktail bar. I think they have some food um, and know-how and I'm so excited. I've never been and I've always wanted to go. It's right above Acme, if you know that club. I was drinking a mom water. We're on to the next. I'm leaving in like 30 minutes. I still don't really know what I'm wearing trying to figure that out. And my Whole Foods delivery just got here, so we need to unbox that. Here's a little Whole Foods haul. It's kind of random. <laughs> um, so like I said, I'm hosting my friends over, or maybe I didn't, I think I did. Tomorrow, my friends Kate and Delaney are coming over to watch the George game at home because we just didn't feel like going to a bar tomorrow. But it's at noon, so we were like brunch vibes. So I got orange juice, they're bringing champagne. I got cinnamon rolls, some bacon. It's just the three of us. Oh, and I got fruit, so chill vibes. These are some of my favorite protein bars and I just needed them again in my life, especially for fashion week. I love to throw them in my bag. Guac, these avocado oil tortilla chips are so good. Broccoli and beef in case I wanna make another ground beef and broccoli dish as like a dinner, more eggs. Orange juice, of course, and green beans because I have meatballs in my freezer and that's one of my favorite meals. I thought I got a half loaf, but looks like they gave me a whole sourdough. Ugh, it smells so good. So I'm gonna put all this away and then figure out what I'm wearing tonight. <laughs> wearing a little tart lip liner and a clear Tower 28 gloss bag. I've got this little set on, got Drake on. Hair is, I'm still learning how to do my hair, but I think it, I think it looks good. Let's go have a night. Cass is like, okay, love being here, but I need some jammies. <laughs> yeah, okay. Do you want some moisturizer? What's yeah, your vibe? I'm gonna need full Let's do some hair. caudalie. And then what else do you usually put on your skin? Um, I usually just do eye skin cream. fix. Oh, eye cream. I, that's this. I have that. Danielle. Guys, Seb, I'm not gonna show it, but Seb put her phone number <laughs> on oh, a so stamp. Funny. And do you have it on you too? Yeah. We were walking around. I don't know if she stamped it on any guys or not. Yeah, she gave someone else that. That's a little hyaluronic acid. So funny. What do you do? You know what I just learned? Hmm. That you're only supposed to put on vitamin C in the morning because it serves as like a barrier. Vitamin day. C? Yeah. So don't call me the skincare guru, but also. Oh, that is interesting because I don't put on vitamin C at night for some reason in the daytime is when it feels right. Yeah, well, in the morning. Do you put on SPF every day? No, me either. Oh yeah, why am I, I'm asking you that? Yeah, yeah no. I'm like, okay, I am. You um, have categories, I'm noticing. Yeah, I did, I organized you, my But you my have color. all the same things. Like, I don't have one product that's the same brand. Oh. But all of your products are like the same brands. You have Tatcha, you have Skin Fix. What's this one? Glow, Glow Recipe. Glow Recipe. This is what she's Authentic. referring to. Now. Like, you, you're loyal. You're a loyal Dr. Janice Gross. I'm a loyal bitch. You're a loyal fucking bitch. Yep. So, so well, hear that, everybody? Cheers to loyalty. Um, do you want anything else? That's kind a of lip. my oh, lip. Also, I hate so, to be the bearer of bad news, but I don't have any a toothbrush. <laughs> so, what would you like to do with that? <laughs> I was thinking that. I, I need to use my finger brush. Yeah. Also, Cass is going to get. Actually, you already know this. You know about my prescription toothpaste. <sighs> Yeah. <laughs> See? Loyal. Look at everything. <laughs> Everything's in like categories, you guys. Well, because I just unpacked, so I was like, let me put them all Look together. Look at your water pack. I've, I've used that like twice. No, she's talking about my body like, glow. Everything's like, yeah. It's cute together, right? No, I love. 
<laughs> Whose toothbrush is that yours? That's my big daddy. Yeah, that's a big boy. This is Ryan's new toothbrush. I mean, I guess you could use it. He could get his new one. <laughs> that Danielle giving me Ryan. I'm like, you could have no, that. But here, ready? Toothbrush. To this Cheers. toothpaste literally looks like ointment. No, not only does it look like ointment, but it tastes like ointment. <laughs> <laughs> it's minty. <laughs> No, we brush our teeth on camera. <laughs> this is pretty vulnerable. <laughs> Good morning. It's 8.30 in the morning. I would have liked to still be asleep, but Cass had a wedding to get to in New Jersey. So she had. She was like, are you gonna kill me if I put an alarm on for eight? As we're going to bed at two, I was like, uh, sure, fine. Okay. But honestly, I've been waking up so early last week that I feel like my body would have woken up anyways. I'm making some coffee and I'm just gonna get back in bed and watch TV because I have TV in my bedroom now, which is so fun. Um, I'm so hungry, but Delaney and Kate aren't getting here until 11.30, so I might have to have some snacks or a snack. Cade ordered Chick-fil-A chicken minis, like catering, <laughs> literally for the three of us. And, uh, the latest that they can deliver that. Oh my God, my doormat are gonna be like, what is this girl doing when the catering comes? The latest they could come is 10, 15. Cause I think, well, I thought breakfast ends at 9.30 at Chick-fil-A. Did they switch it? To, I can't remember. But um, anyways, so I'll be here to accept the chicken minis at 10, 15, no problem. Ooh, maybe I'll have a piece of sourdough. That sounds so good right now. But it was so fun having Cass sleep over. We were like giggly. And then she was like, okay, we have to go to bed. Like it's 2 a.m. I was like, I know. But yeah, last night was fun. Uh, so we went, we started at the nines and then some guy came to our table, not some guy, the waiter came to our table and, he, and Acme is downstairs and he was like, do you guys want to go to Acme? I can bring you guys down. And we were like, sure, that's easy. And we got to bring our drinks from upstairs down to Acme. It was fun. We took over a table because no one was like, no one had bought that table. So they just told us like, if someone buys the table, we'll kick you guys out. But no one did. So we were just, there, the whole time. I'm moving too much, it's too early. Okay, I'm gonna get back in bed. Like, how cozy and divine is this? I'm gonna turn on the TV. Got my Georgia gear on. Making some bacon. Also have some berries. I'm gonna like make this all cute so when they walk in. I don't know what to do about these cinnamons. Do I put them in the oven just to like, like I got them. I wanted to like make them like the ones in the tin or whatever, but they only had these. So I think those are from the bakery, but I want them to be nice and warm and oozy so I can put them in the microwave. Maybe I'll put them in the oven. I'll get the oven going. Guys, my oven is in Celsius. <laughs> so I was like having to look up the conversion <laughs> to see like what to set it at. So that's fun. The Chick-fil-A just got delivered. Cade ordered it to my apartment and he got us a ton of chicken minis and hash browns. He got himself a coffee, so I put it in the fridge, but I'm gonna make a little spread now. Okay, this is not a bad spread. I am so proud. It's literally so not good at all, but like it's just me and two other people, so I'm not gonna like do a whole thing. Also, I forgot that like not everyone likes their bacon burnt like me, so hopefully, I know Delaney does, I just don't know about Cade. And then we've got the berries, we've got the chicken minis that he sent and some hash browns. I just heated up cinnamon rolls, orange juice. I need to get some glasses out. I think they're gonna have mimosas. I think all of my champagne flutes have just broken throughout the years. But I'll like put a glass out for myself in case I wanna like just have some orange juice. Mimosas make me feel weird. I don't know why you guys. Does anyone else feel the same? Like champagne in general, like I like champagne. I enjoy the taste, but I think I'm gonna not drink the rest of this weekend, so. Oh, that's so cute, I gotta take a picture. Vibes. Got college game day on, the game's starting in an hour. Here is my game day fit. Super easy, I love not having to do my makeup right now. Um, Georgia hat, Georgia alumni crew neck, and then some flare leggings or yoga pants, depending on what you call them. Wow, it's so nice to have things on the wall. <laughs> it looks so good. Say hi to my vlog. Hey, Show where you are. Hey, vlog. <laughs> Show where you are. Wow. 
He's on the floor, you guys. That's crazy. Happy game day. We're getting crazy up in here. Kate ordered us Chick fil A. Very excited. I know you like it crispy. I don't know if Cade likes it crispy, but we're gonna find out. Georgia's winning. Go dog. Score is 20 to 3. Fourth quarter. Feeling good about it. 26 to 3. 26 to 3. Oh, yeah, we just got a touchdown. About to be 27 to 3. Boom. It's good. Woohoo. Go dogs. We're learning all the new players' names because there's obviously some new recruits and stuff. So we're learning what the numbers. All the things. We have the same quarterback from last year, but I'm seeing a lot of new names. Dogs win. Woo, aw. He knows whoever that is. Yay, go dogs. Looks so good in here. I'm talking quiet because Delaney's asleep, but I got this bronze shoe rack to match the bronze of this just because I wanted a little bit extra storage in here and I thought this was an easy way to do that. So my thought process here is like rolled up towels. Um, I don't know, I could put toilet paper here, but maybe I want to conceal that. I don't know, I might change my mind and not like this here. It was just like an easy way to have some extra storage and I thought it would look nice, so. Maybe I'll add some baskets. I don't know. What do you guys think? I don't think it looks terrible. I could put like bath salt, stuff like that for my baths once I get some. <laughs> I need to, maybe I'll do that right now while Delaney's asleep is start organizing and putting some of this stuff away. <laughs> Cause this is just not cute. I need to take a bath in here. So Delaney's a real one. She's like, I want to see your rug. And I just have been needing help. Got the sudden urge to move. She's like, let's, <laughs> let's do that. I'm like, all right. Sure. No problem there. got a rug and two out of breath girls trying to because this is like full trying to lift it and get the rug at the same time it was a journey but we did it so it's a jute and wool rug from rugs usa and delaney approves this is the biggest rug i've ever had for shirts ginormous so now we're gonna put the couch back but here's a little before it looks so good you guys i love Love the contrast of these two rugs. We did a pretty good job for just the two of us. You know, we're, when Ryan <laughs> when Ryan gets here, he's gonna help make it a little bit more symmetrical, but you know, we just wanted to get it down. Like trying to get this under there was a the whole thing. I already told you guys that, but I really like it. I actually like these pillows on my couch because it kind of ties in with the rug. Thank you, Delaney. And I am so happy. It feels like this is now the living room. Mm -hmm. Like it feels like it has the living room, the dining room. Perfect. I was watching Clara on TV, but I'm gonna turn her off now on YouTube. Goodbye, Clara. <laughs> I'm gonna put my remote back in my remote box. This is the best thing. I cannot wait to get my coffee table to pull it all together in here. Delaney went home and I just changed because I really wanted to go for a long walk today or do something active. I'm really off my grind. So I'm just doing long walks instead to things that I'm doing. So this is my outfit. Beyond Yoga Tank, Lululemon leggings, New Balance sneakers. Dogs won today. So gotta keep that going. Finally going to see It Ends With Us. Like I've been dying to see this since it came out, obviously. Like I would have been there the first night, but my mom and brother were here and I was moving. So I held off obviously. And now I'm like, it's time. It's a Saturday night. I wanna go see it. Delaney actually already saw it, but she said she'd go see it with me again. So since she like came over to me, she lives over on the east side, I'm gonna go to her and we're gonna go actually to one of my favorite movie. It is my favorite movie theater in Manhattan. It's the Regal Essex Crossing in Lower East Side. Used to be like my movie theater when I lived over there, but it's gonna be like, an hour walk for me, but that's perfect. Like I would go for an hour walk anyway, so let me just walk somewhere. I probably won't walk back because it'll be nighttime, but I'm gonna walk there. So I'm bringing my bag, bringing this bag, which usually if I go for a long walk, I don't really wanna have this, but I obviously need a sweatshirt for the movie theater. I just had some lentil soup. I had like canned lentil soup in my fridge, in my pantry. <sighs> Blowing out the candle for dinner. <laughs> 
And I obviously am getting popcorn when we get there, but until then, darling, that will do. Today was so fun. I'm like so, it was so nice of Delaney to be like, can I help you with your rug? I was like, please, I just didn't want to make you. This isn't your apartment, but she's a real one for that. So um, we're gonna go for a walk. I think I'm gonna walk the really long way and walk along the West Side Highway along the water and then like cut in. So it's like gonna be even longer for me, but I just, I'd rather, I think I'd rather do that. It's kind of cloudy out. What time even is it? Six o'clock on the dot. Okay, if I leave right now, I'll get there right on time. So let's do it. Wow. We are home now. I absolutely sobbed. Um, and I'm making some sleepy time tea. Just don't mind the graphics on my Alexa. And we're gonna get in bed, wind down. We had a really nice day. I'm feeling really grateful. Um, it was nice to just kind of chill and go see a movie on a Saturday. It's nice and cozy in here. I'll see you guys in the morning. open with DSW. I'm really excited to see who else is going. I do know Katie Bilotti's going. So obviously we've been texting and coordinating our outfits. I think we're both wearing like red and white. So really excited about that, but I'm pumped. We're, they're like, we're meeting at Bryant Park and they're actually taking us all together there. I think on a bus or something. This is my first time at the US Open this year. I'm really excited. And yeah, so let's kind of finalize the look together. So here is the dress. It's from Sporty and Rich. I love it. I like how it cinches at the waist and kind of pulls up a little. And then this little sweater is from Lisette. And I'm purposely kind of wearing it more to one side. I think that's really cute. DSW gifted us a pair of shoes, of course, to wear to the match. So I am wearing these Reebok Club C extra shoes, I think, because they've got the platform. They are so flattering on the foot. I just tried them on and my oh my. So I'm gonna put those on and then I'm gonna do this cute little long shot bag. So tennis, so chic, right? But I need to figure out jewelry. Welcome to my closet. Gotta figure out the jewelry. Should I like tie this in a knot so this like definitely stays? It's a high neck, so I obviously don't need a necklace, but I feel like I could do a semi bold earring. Ooh, these little Jenny bird. Yeah, that's it. I'm gonna do these little, I call them my comma earrings. They look like little commas. Just some punctuation, you know? Maybe I'll add some rings too. Oh, and I need to bring a pair of sunglasses even though it's totally cloudy and overcast this morning. I don't think it's supposed to rain. I really hope it doesn't. Um, so we're gonna go to the US Open and then from there, Katie and I are gonna head over to Brooke and Ben's new apartment or condo because it's Ben's birthday's this weekend. They're having a little party for him and slash housewarming, so we're so excited to go. So here are the earrings, and then I have some sunglasses in mind. Let's see, I think I'm gonna like them with this. My Orium round sunglasses? I think so, or I do have these. Hmm, they're so similar. I mean, they're not actually, they're a very different shape. Okay, I just realized the lining on my skirt was messed up earlier, so don't worry, I fixed that. Got the snakes on, they're so good. I decided I'm gonna do these sunglasses. I'm just gonna go fill up my bag. We're taking a ginger shot. I forgot I had gotten one of these earlier this week and it never hurts to start your day with a ginger shot, right? That feels great. My oh 
am I? I'm gonna have it <laughs> I can't even speak, it's so spicy. I'm gonna head out and I'm gonna take you guys along with me. got in the shower and took like a 30 minute long hot shower like boy did that feel good um today was so fun had the best time then stopped by broken ben's for his birthday which was so wholesome they gave us little goodie bags dsw did or it might have been from the us open th to dsw because there wasn't anything dsw in it but we got a us open towel i am so excited though i wanted this hat just like the classic us open hat i'm pumped but i definitely drank a bit today which is weird because it's like still the day like day drinking so weird to me because it's like now i'm kind of having the come down from it i had a few honey deuces those things are so good and i feel so dehydrated because it was obviously pretty warm and i did not drink enough water so we are gonna have one of my favorite things in the world you guys already know an element ever since element released these sparkling waters it has seriously changed the game for me Anytime, like if it's the morning after I was drinking or I'm having a little anxiety, I need something bubbly to just make me feel better. That's what I love about this because it has these electrolytes that I'm gonna have the next morning after drinking or whatever it may be, but it also is sparkling. They also, of course, have the packets, but I am just so on the train of these Element Sparkling Waters. You can get them online and they're absolutely amazing. This is the black cherry lime flavor, it's so good. This is literally, I love it so much. So these have no sugar, which I love. They have 1000 milligrams of sodium, 200 milligrams of potassium, and 60 milligrams of magnesium. You do not have to be an athlete to drink this. It's like when you're dehydrated after working out, or like I said, if you've been drinking the night before, this helps with fatigue, illuminating like headaches, stuff like that, which I absolutely love. And it's just so refreshing. Like I said, there's no sugar, there's no artificial coloring ingredients, they're gluten-free, keto-friendly, all the things. When you sweat, the primary electrolyte that you lose is sodium, so this helps kind of put that back into your system. I love when you guys post your Instagram stories drinking Element. I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm so glad I influenced you because it's so good. I've gotten so many of my friends on it, my family loves it. It's absolutely amazing. It really comes in handy sometimes. And if you guys wanna try a free sample pack of their electrolyte powders, you just go to the drinkelement.com slash Danielle Carolyn, and that'll get you a free sample pack with any purchase. So you can try a flavor, which my personal favorite flavor overall is citrus salt. And then you get the free sample pack with it so you can try all the flavors and see which one you're gonna get next. So it's amazing if you're traveling, you can throw a few in there with you, or you can also get a thing of the sparkling waters and then you get the free sample pack with that. I am such a fan. I love Element so much. I love that I have this little mini fridge here that I can just put all my elements in. It's pretty amazing. Thank you so much to Element for sponsoring this video. Again, I'll have it down below, but it's drinklmnt.com slash Danielle Carolyn to get that free sample pack with any purchase. I have been putting off doing my dishes back there, and I think now's the time as I drink my Element. <laughs> Just unboxed a new purchase, which is my closet ladder. I thought it was gonna be actually more gold, but I guess this looks like really nice. It's like a brass, which matches with my bathroom. I initially bought a clear acrylic one that looked so sick, but they like refunded me on Amazon, so I don't really know what happened, but. So I found this one, which is perfect. The goal was to keep it out, and like, you know, if I just need to like jump up here really quick and grab a pair of shoes, which I guess that's what I'll do. What do you guys think? I think it doesn't look bad. I feel like it looks like it's supposed to be in here. I think it's cool. And I can always like tuck it 
this way I have some clothes folded that I do need to hang up. Okay, yep. Um, but I feel like it looks good. So I'm happy that I finally have that because I've literally not been wearing certain shoes because I'm just like, I don't want to go get the big ladder from over there. So I have a little closet ladder now. So that's, that's exciting. I also need to clear this area right here because I think I'm gonna put my hamper right here. I have like two baskets over there that I used as hampers in my last place, but I might put them in my living room to put the blankets in, I'm not really sure. But because I want a hamper that has rollers on it, like rollers, <laughs> wheels, so I can wheel it um, all the way to the laundry. I just got mine in the mail, I'm gonna put it together. Hopefully it looks like how it did online because I liked it, it's just simple, but it has wheels. So I'm gonna put something on the TV and put this together. We have a rolling hamper so I can roll it all the way over to my washer and dryer when I do laundry. I feel like this is just like a random game changer. I'm very excited about it. Um, I also got one that has a divider. So as I'm putting my laundry in here, like my dirty stuff, I could do lights and darks so that the day I do laundry, I don't have to like go through and touch. My I don't really love touching my dirty laundry, <laughs> like more than I have to. I'm like, ugh, like. You know, because I know I'm like sweating and stuff. I don't know, is that weird? But anyways, yeah, so that way as I put it in, I'm like, okay, this is a light, this is a dark. I know where to go. Oh my God, the wheels are such a game changer, how cute. So I need to clear up this area so I can put it there. I mean, I feel like that makes the most sense because like before I get in the shower, I can just throw my stuff in there. So we love her, we love her so much. Guys, this is so ideal. I just wheeled this over. I'm doing my darks first. Got all of my lights on this side. This is really ideal, I gotta say. Everybody. I'm having just the most fabulous morning to myself listening to Coffee House Guitar. It's a playlist on Spotify. I highly suggest it. It's really calming. But I need to find a plant for over there next to my TV console. And I'm really leaning towards getting a real plant because apparently it's just so good for the air. It cleanses your air. Um, and apparently easy plants are really easy to take care of or actually I don't know about the sill I don't know if that one waters itself, but I know this website easy plant all of their plants water themselves Like you just have to water it once a month or something So I'm I really wanted to do an olive tree. I wonder if that's on here <laughs> My brother saw my I just posted on my store My brother posted that snake plants are like the best for cleaning your air, but I don't know guys, and a few of you have DM'd me that too, but it's just looking, I don't think this type of plant fits the space. Like it's just not the vibe. So I'm just trying to figure out which one I like the best. I feel like this is nice, Ficus Benjamina. Can reach up to three to six feet tall indoors. Oh my God, it's gonna grow. I kind of like this Ficus Benjamina. What kind of light does he require? Oh, and there's all these different stands. This is so bouge. I love this. It's Labor Day, happy Labor Day. Um, I did the dishes, I've got laundry going. Today is kind of my Sunday, since yesterday was kind of not chill at all, but so fun. Um, Delaney's headed over right now and we are gonna tan on my roof. I am so excited. We don't necessarily have like tanning chairs up there, but there is this like big L couch thing that we're just gonna lay on and bring towels up and enjoy it because I don't wanna get a spray tan for fashion week so I really need to get some natural color from the sun. So hoping for that today. Um, I'm just wearing this little zebra bikini and then this little Amazon cover up skirt situation. Um, the UV is five right now so I have high hopes and the sun is like really out right now. So I'm hoping, let's see what the UV is now. I'm such a UV checker. We're at six, we will take it, we are at six. So I'm just packing my little beach bag. Now that I have hair extensions, I have to go back to using mineral sunscreen. <laughs> um, so I actually have some of this Sol de Janeiro mineral sunscreen. It actually smells really good. I brought it on The Bachelorette. I went on like a week or two ago and everyone's like, what's that smell? It smells so good. So. We do love that because if you wear regular sunscreen, I do have regular sunscreen on my face and that's never been a problem for me in the past. 
Um, but if you don't wear mineral sunscreen, your hair extensions could turn pink and they have for me before. And I had to go get an emergency hair treatment. So um, I'm also bringing this little Evian facial spray in, in case we get hot. Got my Kindle, of course, from the Kindle event I made. Um, this little case, and it's so fun. Emotional support Kindle, like so cute. I also just love having a case. I can just tap, 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 tap. And it doesn't automatically turn on anymore. I've never had a case for all the years I've had a Kindle. Tatcha sunscreen for my face, mini hairbrush, keys, a hair tie to put my hair up. And then I'm gonna bring a towel, of course, up. But it's kind of nice. I just get to press roof on the elevator and we'll go right up. So I have a pretty good tan right now, but I'd love to just lock it in today. I don't really think I have time anymore the rest of this week, like during the prime tanning hours. Yeah, I don't. So praying that I'll get it all in today. Wow, this is incredible. Uh, I don't want summer to end. I know it's so unpopular, but I love it so much. Uh. We are back from the roof. We've got a little bit of a tan line, so really happy. I tried to lay on my stomach a little bit, so I, my back gets tan, because I always have a problem where I just tan the front, and then like my whole backside just looks totally different. Um, but yeah, we were out there for almost three hours. During that, we kept checking the UV. I think the highest we hit was seven, which we'll take. And it's officially September also, wow. I mean, yesterday is the first day of September, but. Delaney texted me yesterday and said, happy birth month. I did. It was really nice of you. I don't think I did that for you. It was, really nice. <laughs> it was so nice. Um, I'm making a quick salad because I'm going to get a facial. Um, I'm really excited about it because being off birth control, I'm starting to see the effects <laughs> of having the pimple. So I'm going to get that taken care of with a hydrofacial. Making myself a quick salad. You guys already know the drill. My favorite little salad I've been making. And that's it. I know my hair looks crazy, but salad is done. I'm gonna mix it around. I like to like shake it up, but I don't have a lid for this smaller bowl. Oh, it's so good and like refreshing. Yeah. And then I'm gonna shower and then we're gonna go. Guys, I just got a little whole food delivery. Ryan's here and we're cooking right now, but my walk was so good. An hour and 20 minute walk. I found these. They're sparkling water, but they're ginger sparkling water. Could go either way, but I'm I'm gonna like it. Listening to some Frank Sinatra, some jazz. Made, of course, one of my go tos right now ground beef and broccoli with this teriyaki sauce. And then once we plate them, we also have some rice over there. We do some sesame seeds on top. Sweet Ryan is building a shoe rack for me. I got one more for my closet. Here's my little Whole Foods haul. Just wanted to get some snacks for fashion week, so I have like little things to grab and go. Um, good culture cottage cheese, my favorite stuff ever. I got some of these single little hummus packs so I could bring like hummus and some pretzels in the car in like a baggie or baby carrots, grapes, some more sleepy time tea, and then a couple bananas. Gosh, I have missed having football on. It's just like a soothing sound. Oh my gosh, Boston College got a touchdown, Ryan. Oh my God. I'm doing the dishes. I'm cleaning off my stove. Like, I don't do this a lot. This is only on special days. <laughs> more shoe rags, more shoe rags. Yay. Well, cause there was the space there. So we were like, I might as well just order one more. So it's even. Do you like my new cute little step ladder? <laughs> Woohoo! Hopefully it fits. It's supposed to. <laughs> oh wait, the hats are in the way? Okay, I gotta, I gotta, these things connect into each other. Wait, they really do? Oh, sick. We'll stay in place. Yay! Thank you so much. Oh, here. You take on him. Yeah, you cowboy. Yeah, girl. Ryan just left. I've got my work cut out for me, folding all this laundry. That is the end of this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. I feel like it was a really well-balanced weekend. Got lots of stuff done at my apartment, which is always nice. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time for my next video. Bye.